We are checking out a different type of home today, something that we haven't covered on the channel yet, and I'm excited to share it with you all. It is a active adult community home, 55 and over, located in Gainesville, Virginia. Specifically, it's the Heritage Hunt neighborhood. I'm Stephen Ellis with Ellis Properties, and we are checking out a home on Whirlaway Court. It's a four-bedroom, three-bathroom home, just over 4,000 square feet, 4,225 to be precise. A lot of that is going to be on the main level, 2,293, and it's a main level living home. So everything you need is going to be on this main level. It's on an awesome lot, got a lot of woods, got a lot of trees back there, a lot of privacy, so excited to show it to you. Once you walk in the home, you have your, basically your huge family room is right there in front of you with your dining room to the right that we just saw, and we are working our way into the kitchen. There's a small mud room separating the kitchen to the garage, and that's where your laundry is going to be. A two-car garage, I think you got to call it a one and a half just because some of those stairs are going to get in the way. But nonetheless, you're going to have room for a large SUV or I think you could probably squeeze two, but it would be tight for sure. You got a little pantry off of the kitchen and then we're going to take a look at the rest of the kitchen so brand new granite that they just put in on this home there's brand new stainless steel appliances so they did some updates in here which is great to see everything in this neighborhood is going to be electric ranges so no gas stoves unfortunately you're going to be confined to electric but at least it's a brand new appliance and taking a look at the eat-in room so just off the kitchen you're going to have room for a eat-in kitchen separate from the dining space a little less formal and then your big old family room gas fireplace and my favorite room of this entire home isn't the biggest but it's the brightest it's the sun room back here that has access to your deck and check out this lot this is what i was talking about it's tough to find in heritage hunt you're going to find some pretty cool lots in here that back up to the golf course and give you a little bit of privacy but it's really tough to find a lot like this in heritage hunt that is at the end of a cul-de-sac you got some walking trails right next to your home and no direct neighbors are going to be peeking into your backyard or on your deck or anything like that so this is a main level living home. You're gonna have two bedrooms on the main level and then two bedrooms on the basement. And this is the primary. Brand new carpet just put in here, brand new paint. And then of course you have your bathroom that is attached to it. A large soaking tub, walk-in shower, split dual vanities there. You have your water closet, some fresh tile work. And again, brand new paint in here. You have this huge window sitting right above the soaking tub, letting in all the natural light for your bathroom. A great touch. Checking out the shower. And then how about this huge master closet? You got shelving wrapping all the way around, very deep back there. I don't think you're gonna have any issue over storage or room for your clothes. One last look at the water closet. And that pretty much wraps up the primary suite. It is at the back of the house, the back corner, so you're gonna have plenty of windows letting in natural light too, similar to that bathroom. Um, I think it's really nice how they put it in the back of the house versus the front of the house, just to ensure you get some of that privacy too. One additional room on the main level is this office, or if you're gonna make it a craft room, anything like that. Uh, pretty flexible open space in there with the French doors. Giving you a quick look down to the basement, and then we have our second bathroom on the main level just across the hall from that is the second bedroom not huge by any means but it's definitely big enough for a queen or king size bed a dresser and then it's nice to have that bathroom across the hall although it's not attached you're going to be using that bathroom has your powder room but also if you have any guests in the house they'll be able to access that room with the shower and everything working our way downstairs a lot of homes in heritage hunt will have a basement and then you're going to find some homes that don't or maybe it's just not finished they have finished pretty much every inch of this basement and they've done so by adding two additional bedrooms uh, closets in each one and then they also finished the bathroom down here and they did a really nice job finishing you're going to see that in a second so this is the larger of the two bedrooms 
two big windows letting in the natural light, and then this is the bathroom that I was speaking about. A huge walk-in shower, floor to ceiling tile, great tile work in there. Love the floors that they did as well, a brand new vanity mirror, everything. Brand new, absolutely beautiful in here, gutted from top to bottom. I like what they did. So checking out the rest of the basement. You got a huge rec room space here. They continued the gas fireplace that was upstairs down to here. And then you also have your walk out basement. Checking out the next bedroom. Again, they've got a closet in here for you, two windows, a lot of natural light coming in. Even though this is a basement, it felt very bright just walking through it. Didn't feel like a dark, dingy basement, and that's just because most of the basement is above ground versus below ground, so you have those huge windows. Your last bonus room is there, although it is not a legal bedroom. You can make it a bedroom if you needed to. There's no window for it, but... If you needed to convert that to storage, you could have that option too. And then one last look at the other storage room. So again, a ton of space down here. Some of it might not be necessary or you might not need all this space. I know that some of the buyers that I was working with when showing this home said it's nice to have, but not a necessity. So Heritage Hunt also offers condos and attached homes, smaller square footage that might be more your style. Hopefully you like this tour of Heritage Hunt and this home over on Whirlaway Court. If you have other questions, feel free to reach out.